Hi. Uh, we are going to make a video to explain uh, why we chose the recipe of green juice and what a typical day of for us is. Uh, we've had some questions on YouTube and Facebook asking us to make a video like that and so that's what this video is for. Um, first of all, our base every day is green juice. Um, we don't really deviate from our juice recipe at all. Um, when we do, it's in addition to. So our goal is to, for Rigo, he drinks three juices a day. I um, drink three to five now that I'm pregnant. Before I was pregnant, I would drink three. Sometimes I'll drink up to five now, depending on how I'm feeling. Um, the kids usually drink about two a day unless they've been exposed to a sickness then we'll bump them up to three a day for a few days until that we know that the sickness is not cultivating in their system um, so our base is the green juice we chose the recipe because I did research on every vegetable every fruit and I tried to put together a combination that would give us 100% of the FDA requirements for vitamins and minerals. Um, and that's what this juice recipe does. So, but I also needed it to taste good enough that the kids would like it. So, that's how we came up with the recipe. It took months of research to come up with this recipe. Um, we've played with it a little bit. A couple different times and we have found that this is the one that the kids will drink this is the one that ki the kids like and is the has the nutrients that we need so we've stuck with that from here on out from then on out um, we still drink it today and so we know what our body is required according to FDA our bodies required a certain amount of vitamins and minerals so because of that the kids get two juices to to give them those vitamins and minerals we drink three to get the vitamins and minerals sometimes I will drink extra now that I'm pregnant to help the growing baby and it might be why I'm growing so fast uh, because the baby does have everything it needs to grow um, a typical day for us aside from the juice is we wake up in the morning and the first thing we do is drink water Rigo and I drink one liter of water immediately upon rising. We don't eat anything, we don't even brush our teeth, we don't drink anything until we drink the water. Uh, one liter for Rigo and I. Uh, the kids drink about half a liter in the morning when they first wake up. Then we will have breakfast. Rigo likes to have a heavier breakfast. He likes to have pancakes or French toast or oatmeal usually. Um, the kids like to have a lighter breakfast usually. Sometimes they will have pancakes or french toast, but they don't usually like to have the oatmeal. The oatmeal is a little bit heavier on their stomach. So they'll have fruit or we'll have a superfood smoothie in the morning. Um, then we kind of snack a little bit between then and lunch on fruit. Um, at lunchtime, the kids, I pack their lunches. It's usually three different types of fruit and some kind of dehydrated item. It might be oatmeal, oatmeal cookies. I'll use the leftover oatmeal and make oatmeal cookies and then put those in their lunch box. Then when they eat those cookies and drink water, it's like they had a bowl of oatmeal. It keeps them full. Sometimes I give them uh, some onion bread and they can have like a sandwich. Sometimes Rigo will have that. Rigo drinks his juices at work. So he'll have his three juices. He usually has his superfood shake and then he'll have a couple pieces of fruit and maybe some nuts, nut mix or an avocado sandwich in there, something like that. And a lot of times he come, he gets home and there's still a couple things left in his lunchbox. The kids usually have something left in their lunchbox too. Um, so it's just a little bit of dehydrated um, items depending on what we have available at the time. And 
fruit and juice. When I pick the kids up at school, I personally just kind of snack on fruit. Sometimes in the afternoon I'll have an avocado. I like guacamole a lot, so a lot of times I'll cut up an avocado, I'll put lemon juice and the Himalayan sea salt. I don't even put the salsa in there. I just smash it up and I'll eat it with a spoon. I know it's weird, but I really like it. Sometimes I'll mix it with some cucumber or cauliflower, something like that. Um, so that's what I would eat. Then, um, after school, when I pick the kids up from school, the first thing they do is drink a juice. And then they will drink another, they do drink another half liter of water at school. So they've got a, a liter in. Uh, Rigo drinks usually one to two liters of water at work. I drink two to three liters of water throughout the day. Well, one in the morning and then one to two more throughout the day. And then, so the kids get their juice. They'll drink a little more water. They usually eat whatever's left in their lunch. Um, then Regal gets home and we have dinner. Dinner consists of, you know, sometimes it's salad, sometimes it's popcorn chicken. Uh, raw popcorn chicken, you'll see the recipe soon, um, or pizza, or one of our raw recipes um, is usually what we'll have for dinner. So dinner is the heavier meal, the more fatty meal, the... Now, and this is, of course, we're a year into it. So if you're just beginning, you may want more substantial food throughout the day. But we do that usually around 7 um, a lot of times we do have a treat about, what, 8, 9 o'clock. We'll have some chocolate or ice cream or we like to have our treats. Um, there's a lot of great benefits in raw food, sweets. And so we love our sweets. We'll have caramel apples, whatever. Uh, and then usually we drink a little more water before we go to bed. And that's it, right? Can you think of something I'm missing? With me, to be honest, right now, I'm kind of all over the board. There's some days where I don't really want a lot of food and I do a lot more drinking. I'll drink more juice. And then there's some days where I'm starving because I'm pregnant and I'll sit there and eat five handfuls of cashews. That just happened yesterday. And I'm not a cashew eater. But, I mean, stuff that I notice I never eat, I have been eating like crazy. Eating oranges, eating cashews, eating sunflower seeds, eating raisins. So me, right now, I'm all over the board just because I'm pregnant. I eat whatever looks good. Yesterday, half a bag of grapes. And I have never in my life liked grapes. So, <laughs> I don't, you can't really go off of me. But, um, that's what we eat.